everybody, welcome back to the Rokaja Kebab channel. Caleb Carr, whatever you want to call me, I'm back again. So, here's the story. I went I went to sleep last night, I posted that reaction, if you haven't seen it, go watch it, um, to TXT's newest song. And um, I uploaded it, edited it, and then went to sleep, woke up the next day and I realised I didn't actually listen to the album. So, that's what we're here today doing. We're just going to do a you know, quick skim of the album, quick skim of the album and you know, listen to all the songs, give us, give me your, th I'll give you my thoughts, bruh. Um, yeah, so, like I said in that reaction, again, if you haven't seen it, go watch it. Um, TXT is definitely one of my favourite um, boy groups out there in K-pop right now. And I've always, I'm always interested to see what their albums do. I really enjoyed the last few albums, like I said. And so today we're going to be listening to Opening Sequence, Trust Fund Baby, Lonely Boy, and Thursday's, Thursday's Child has far to go. So, if you guys have not subscribed to this YouTube channel, I suggest you do so. We, you know, we've been pumping out some good content lately. Um, like this video, comment on this video, share this video. Tell me what you guys want want us to react to. It could be old, could be new, uh, it could be literally whatever you want it to be. Um, without further ado, we're just gonna get into the first song, opening sequence. Ooh, starting off with that fresh. I like it. Okay. Wow, this is yeah, this feels like a like an anime opening, I mean, hence the title. Oh, that goes on. Oh, something about it's like, feels upbeat, even though it's like more of a slower tempo. So good in there. What? This is really good. This sounds like a song that you just sit down and listen to. Just vibe out. Taehyung is, he's also got a hard hitting This is a beautiful song. Ooh, that change up. I like that sound though. Yeah, yeah, that song was, that was good. Like, it was very, it, it did the same, like, you know, it's not not super exciting in terms of like, it does change a lot, but that's a nice song in terms of like, the beat was really nice, their voices, amazing. Taehyun actually killed in that song, you know, with the chorus, their hard hitting vocals that he had, like really suited the, the beat, and especially that switch up in the end. I liked that, I liked it very, very much. You know, as a B-side, it's definitely very, very good. It's something that I'll put in my playlist and listen over and over. Um, you know, 
really good. I really enjoyed that. So, uh, out of 10, I'd say it's a solid 8 out of 10 alongside, you know, Good Boy Gone Bad. It's, um, you know, a good song. I like it. Uh, all right. So, the next song on our list is Trust Fun Baby. So, I'm just going to get straight into it. Let's go. Alright, so this is going to be the slower song of the album. I like it. I can already tell the song's not going to be super my style, but, and I'm not, you know, it, didn't, it hasn't caught me quite yet, but, you know. <laughs> One positive the song definitely has uh, so far is the beat is very, very soothing and nice. I like it. I like it. The tone of the song, like in terms of their like, vocals, is really good though, despite me not really. Uh, Liking the liking the words and the the structure of it, but yeah, it's pretty nice. Alright, so that's it for that song. Um, uh, definitely on the weaker side, if I'm being honest. Um, not super amazing. I didn't find it very very interesting. I, like I said during the, I, I liked the beat. The beat was really good. Um, their vocal quality, uh, really, 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 really liked it. Um, yeah, but nah, just uh, if I'm being honest, it's definitely out of ten. I would definitely give it more of like a. It's not a bad song, so I'd probably give it like a six. Um, I didn't find it find it super super interesting. So uh, that that that's just that's just me, you know. I guarantee a lot of people will like the song regardless, no matter what I think. It's still, still a wonderful song at the end of the day. Uh, our next song that will be the next song on the list is Lonely Boy. So hopefully it's uh, hopefully we can start moving on to the really, 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 really good songs. I like the pictures these people use for the, um, for the lyrics. The pictures are gangsta. I like the strumming in the background. I really like that. Oh yeah. What? Oh, he's eating these though. I like this so far. The simple strumming and the simple beat is pretty good, and Yonjo's killing it on the rap. And then Kyung and Kai is, you know, vocals is on point too.
But his rapping skills are, are pretty good. They're really good. I'm just noticing now, is this a song with only Yeonjun and, and Kai? Is it the only two that are sounding? So? Must be. I really like the strumming in the back. It really suits the. It really suits the the song. That's what it is. Yeah. It just seems like yeah, a super groovy song. That's what it feels like. I like it. I like it. Sorry about it with the runs. Yeah, so that song was just Yeonjun and Kai. I really enjoyed that actually. It's not again this though, like I think for most of this album it's actually been like not sort of playing it safe, but just you know, can like doing the just doing simple, simple music, but still good. I like the strumming and the chorus. Kai's vocal was amazing, was really good, I really enjoyed it. Um Yeonjun's rapping. He killed it. He killed it on the raps, and then the beat switch, and then into the back into the simple strumming of the um, the chorus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was good. That was good. That was a solid. That's a solid seven out of ten. Seven point five out of ten. I say I say that because it's like I, I was just baffled that I I only realized halfway through the song that it was only Yonjun and it was only Kai that was actually in the song. So I'm assuming that means our last song that will be re um, on the album is Thursday's Child Has Far To Go, such a long title. I assume that will be the three of them, that will be Subin, Bomgyu and Taehyun, surely. So, you know, let's get into that last song. Fortnite Battle Pass, I just shit out my ass. I like the, I like that, I like the symbol. That slow, slow build up into it. And that little background, the little, I like that. Oh, I like this beat. Bro, these photos are crazy on, the, on these, rea on these uh, lyrics videos, man. This is good. This is good. Ah, uh, it, it feels like it's building up to the course. Am I right? Yeah, yeah. Taking on these choruses have been like, he's been so consistently good. Oh, the beat, that beat is a little, you know, the little instrumental in the background. I, li I like this, this right here. That's nice. I like this. Back into the chorus, Taehyun. 
I like this, I like this. This is probably my favorite of the album, if I'm being real. Like, aside from the, um, the title track. Please, please. Yeah, that was good. I liked it. I'm liking this. Really, I, I'm very, very much interested in this instrumental. It's like so good. What? Yes, 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 yes. I assumed that was it. So, um, yeah. So, well, yeah. So there was two songs that didn't have ever remember in it. You know, the last one that we um. Holy hell! I forgot the the name of the song already. Lonely boy. So lonely boy only had Yonjun and Kai, and then this song had the last three members. I really enjoyed it. The instrumental, it felt, had a similar sound to it. Was it like blinding light, sort of that little, um, just instrumental part that wasn't much like, there wasn't much singing in it. Um, that felt like, you know, a little bit of a uh, blinding lights in there. But yeah, if I'm being honest, I think this song is probably out of the five songs, out of the four songs, sorry. Apart from the title track, I would say this is probably my favorite song. It had, again, this album very very simple but it was very 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 done well yeah I, I liked all the songs maybe not as trust fun baby not as much but um you know it's it still was a good song to you know listen to it's not definitely the song's definitely maybe an 8.5 maybe a 9 i'd probably lean towards probably more 8.5 um overall this album was really good you know uh nothing more else to say but that like it really was just all the songs are pretty good. Trust Fun Baby was a bit like, cause I compare it to like something, it was slower song and it made me compare it to something like Anti-Romantic, which is, that's just like probably one of their best songs all time. But yeah, overall, I'd say solid album, solid eight out of 10 album, you know, nothing amazing. Oh, that, that's a lie. They're amazing. Their, their skills, their talent, they're amazing. But you know, as, as the songs, it wasn't as uh, some of the songs, Again, Trust Fund Baby just uh, probably wasn't my style. A lot of people would have liked it. I mean, personally uh, was not super, super humongous fan of it, but you know, digress. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed it, please like the video. You know, I'd very much appreciate it. Comment down below as well if you guys want to see any kind of different reactions, whatever. If you want to see more like reactions to the B sides, listening to it and giving giving us your thoughts on the. the um, album itself you know but uh no nothing else much to say i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day hope you guys are you know doing well and uh i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out